just a quick um, um, lesson on how to develop and cut plates to use for metal boats. Uh, people think you, knew, you need to get a CAD file, a DFX file, and send them away to an aluminium company at great, and have it returned at great cost. You don't need to do that at all. So once you've got your plate development, you then draw a, a box the same size as your plate. In this case, it's nine meters by 2200 millimeters. And then you divide, say, the, the line into whatever you think is manageable. In this case, I divided this line by nine points and then you measure then you measure down from that top edge of the plate whatever it is there in that case it's 130 um, in this case uh, I've only got one hand so it's a bit awkward and you mark you you measure down um, the plate and you measure from there to there, there to there, there to there and then you of course you measure up from the bottom line of the plate um, which is the here you just measure up from that bottom line of the plate and the plates are probably going to be a lot smaller than this one so you take all your dimensions and then you take a long baton Ideal battens in timber are um, 20 millimeter square cedar because they hold their shape or just um, in long gradual curves like this a piece of aluminium half inch square or 13 mil square 20 mil square you just weight it along there all your marks you weight these are called offsets you just weight your batten all along there let it overhang here so you get um a fair curve then you mark it with a what they call a sharpie I'd never really heard that term until recently and um, you just mark it with a sharpie and then you come along with a saw like an electric saw with an aluminium cutting blade on it um, you're standing either side of the line you're probably kneeling on the plate oh, I used to stand up and crouch over it but I can't do that anymore as I had a stroke you just run around this and you can cut so fast and so accurately you just take out the black sharpie line and it will be so accurate you won't need to grind it you won't need to do anything like that so that's the way I've done hundreds of boats well not hundreds but 32 to be exact so there you are